Oh my goodness, what was that? Good morning, everyone. It is an absolute beaut of a morning out here. Um, it's about 6 a.m. The sun is about to rise here this morning out on the river, and we're going to be chasing some topwater smallmouth bass. Uh, in my last video, I did some shore fishing, and we ended up catching a lot of fish in the Lake X lures, little bastard. Today, we'll throw a little bit more topwater. We'll throw some whopper ploppers. We'll throw that little bastard. We might throw some skitter props as well. The topwater bite has been on absolute fire the past few days on the river, and stay tuned because you guys aren't going to want to miss the excitement. How does that paddle keep dragging in the water? There we go, we're on. Decent smallie. Wow, he's flying down river. He is flying down river. Oh wow, that was not good. That's how you end up pulling hooks right out of a fish. Ooh, that's a decent one. That is a very decent one. Oh, he just gave me gave me quite a bath there. Wow, he's just giving me bath upon bath right now. I cannot get close enough to, oh wow, I'm gonna hit that rock, jeez. Dangerous. Oh, that is just a freaking, that's a nice smallmouth. Oh, I got him too. I got him. We gotta get a tape on this guy. I'm gonna hold him in the water while I get the tape ready. Oh yeah, this'll work. We'll just measure him right across my lap. Who cares? Who cares if I get a little slimed up? We're gonna measure him. Ooh, it's a 19. Nice, 19 inch smallmouth. Right behind that mid-river structure, those big boulders, he just popped it. Let's get him, get him off and going. And let's get back to it. Um, I'm gonna be doing a little bit of fishing offshore and a little bit out in the kayak. There's some mid-river structure that I wanna hit with the low water levels that we're having. It's really pushing fish towards some of this mid-river stuff, like this boulder I'm fishing behind right now. And then we're also gonna hop out of the kayak and we're gonna fish some shoreline structure as well. So stay tuned and uh, we're gonna keep catching them. I'm probably not gonna include all of these lost fish in the video, but uh, just to give you guys a reference point for how how bad my hooking percentage has been, I think I've missed my last like five fish in a row. It's been pretty brutal. So as many fish as you guys are gonna see caught in this video, there were so many more that I missed and I just wasn't able to get. probably gonna get off again right I've been losing so many fish today that's why I say that <laughs> hopefully this one doesn't get off it's not real big but whoa he just about jumped right in with me wow whoa dangerous okay well he got off
Ooh. That was, uh, that's gotta be a decent smallmouth. The way he's pulling. Oh yeah. Yup, that's a good one. Oh man. Um, I'm not really quite sure what to do with you. He's just shaking all over the place. And I don't want that hook in my hand. I'm really worried about that. I'm gonna give him a little line. I'm gonna put the butt end of the rod down in there. I'm gonna grab the line. And I got him. I got him. Make sure we are careful not to get you hooked in the gill. Oh, he was not hooked by much either. Another solid, solid smallmouth there. Gosh, these things are just tanks out here. Do a quick lap measurement here with our <laughs> sort of crappy Rapala measuring board. Oh, it's another one that's just, that's ah, just at 19. Another 19 inch fish. Gosh, these things are just beautiful. Get, uh, get a nice release shot of him here. Oh, nice fish. Just a brute. All right, let's get over in there. Time to get out of the kayak officially. I've been talking about it long enough. Gonna get out of the kayak and do some shore fishing. Ooh, there we go. Oh, that's a big smallmouth. I have to get up there. Gosh, that's a big smallmouth. That is not small. Nice. Not as big as I thought it was, but it's a decent fish. Very decent fish. Oh yeah, very good fish. All right, Let's see if I can get you. Oh, yeah, he's got some length to him. Oh, we gotta be careful with his eye. Oh, we've got a poor guy. Oh, ouch, that cut me. Yup, ouch, that was his revenge. Ow, that hurt. That was me being stupid. We're gonna be a little bit more careful this time around. Nice smallmouth there. Got a little blood to go with it. We're gonna be all right. He's gonna be all right. Get him back. Oh, that was a decent fish. I got him. Not as big as I thought, but not bad. Man, I feel like I keep saying that. Not as big as I thought. <laughs> but it's not a bad smallmouth. Not a bad smallmouth at all. Very decent fish. Yeah. Yeah, you are kind of a football. Um, okay. Let's see if we can get the uh, hook out of here. 
without causing myself any more damage or the fish. And we got another one. Not a bad little fish. We'll get this guy back. Another one on the skitter prop. The skitter prop is starting to heat up. Who needs whopper ploppers? Oh my goodness, what was that? That has to be big. That made a huge boil. Oh yeah, not bad. Not bad at all. Oh yeah, that's a freaking toad. I don't know what to do. Oh, that's just a freaking toad. You're gonna get off, aren't you? I'm gonna lose you. Oh, I almost had you. I almost had you, and you're about to get off. Oh no. I got him. Oh, I got him. Just, I watched a hook pop out. There's one hook left in his mouth. Man, I don't know how big this thing is, but it's a freaking toad. I gotta get the hooks out. Hand landed him and everything. Oh, that's a beast. How big are you, man? Just shy of 20 inches. Just shy of 20, that's a 19 and three quarter inch fish right there on the skitter prop. Oh my gosh, just a freaking tank. We'll get him back. Wow, that, thing's, that fish has got some length and some thickness to it. There she goes. Wow. Well guys, I think we're gonna call that a wrap on our video for the day. Did a little bit of fishing out of the kayak. We did some fishing on shore as well. And the fish were cooperative today on the river, so it was a great day. I know I had a lot of fun out here, and I hope you guys enjoyed the video as well. I'm looking forward to having you guys come along on my next fishing adventure. We'll see you guys next time.